Hey there, it's your gamer friend Petey, and we are back in Petedelphia, the city that is now $16,000 an hour in debt. Awesome. <clears throat> so I've come to a conclusion. Um, hello, airplane. Uh, what we really need to do, I'm going to schedule an event, I don't care if it's just, oh, it's already, never mind, it's already, we already have an event scheduled. Good, good work. Uh, $25,000 a day in profit on that. How about this guy? How is this one doing? $7,500 in name profit. Well, it's getting there. Considering they're in competition, it's not too bad, I guess. Got stuff growing. Um, once this these buildings build, <laughs> that's not too much of a awkward way of saying it. Once these buildings are built, we should um, be back to our normal $10,000 an hour in debt. But um, I've come to a conclusion, which is I'll never be able to get 295,000 people in this city uh, this way. What I need to do, because this new SimCity game is about regions, right? And we only have one city, and I can't do it all in one city. We need to get a Department of Transportation going in another city, which will then allow this city to exploit the Department of Transportation. You know, or whatever you want to say. Um, you know, take advantage of it. I exploit it's a little negative, right? But, uh, <clears throat> so we, we pretty much need to... I, I'm just going to get this city uh, as operational as possible. And I don't know how I'm going to do that. But they're complaining about an injury. And there's a hospital right here. Does that make sense to anyone? I don't think so. Um... Yeah, so I'm just going to let the city do its thing. Uh, police coverage. Enough room to increase density. Well, here, hold on a second. What happens if we take the street out? Here, let's use my magic bulldozing tool. Where are you? There we are. My cat's head. We have some abandoned buildings we need to take care of. Okay, look, we can take that out, no problem. What about this one? That will take out this but it's already too small what I want to do is I want to bulldoze this and I want to make this this uh, road go right across here so let's just take off hey we're getting uh, attacked by uh, UFOs great that's what we need um well there's nothing I can do should we zoom in and watch them destroy our city oops where are you UFOs where are the UFOs Zoomed out as far as I can go. Oh, there they are. There. Ah. Well, at least it's not destroying the city, right? Oh, it, it's going to take out one of the buildings. All right. Now what they do? Need workers. I have to go over here. Let's see. You can barely see them because he's outside of our outside of our region. I hope they come in peace. Oh, that's cute. Oh, here's another one up here. Okay, this one. Oh, that one's not being very peaceful. Just took out a building. Thanks, you jerk. Okay. Alien stole my grandma. <laughs> um, Alright, so let's go back to what we were doing, which was trying to get... Uh, where were we? Zoom out a little bit. Okay. Yeah, damn it. I didn't want that road to go there because we're building the streetcar thing right here. Crunch, crunch, crunch. Sorry. And now we're going to take this guy out. Let's see. And should we take... What does this take out? It takes out a park and a vacant business. Mm, I guess I'll leave that for now. Can this go? That can go. But this. Oh, I just took out something. <laughs> oh well. Um. Uh, nothing like bulldoze first, ask questions later. Um. Let's see. Uh, where is our trans streetcars? Um. Streetcar stop. We put one right there. We're getting a lot more transit going. Uh, it's in yellow for some reason. Average wait 19 minutes. 
55,000 riders a day. That's pretty good, right? Um, we really need to find a place to put our university, though. Um, I really want to save this chunk for our new trade depot once we get our transportation sector thing going. So I was thinking, let's look at our values here. Um, let's see, population map. Let's look at that real fast. Tourists. Oh, there are tourists. Good. Yep. Staying at the, oh, they're at the expo center. Oh. How is that doing? What time is it? It's 6.39. Okay, well, see, so we made $58,000. Yeah. Maybe we'll get to... Hmm. Might get to 70 or so. 80, maybe even. Let's try to figure out where we can put a university now that we've destroyed our little universe. <laughs> um, so, well, there is this big space here, but... Okay, this is an abandoned building. What if we... This is, I think this is our low wealth area though, isn't it? This is like my, my pop, dense population low wealth area. Let's see. Um, yeah, see that's sort of like medium low wealth, but th th it's an abandoned building anyway. So let, do I have enough money for university? Education. University. Overlapping. Well, it fits right there. That's the part that's doing well, <laughs> um, unfortunately. Oh, I can turn it side. Oh, if I put it there, I can turn it. No, it's still going to take out that building, isn't it? All right, what if... Uh... No, it, it's because it's interfering with the, uh, the garbage dump. All right, you know what? No, we'll turn it that way. All right, um, it's going in. I don't care. All right. So that makes a little bit of people happy. Um, I probably should have put it all the way over there so there'd be room. Let's go ahead and look at our what time. Is it 10 o'clock? Oh, I forgot to see. Oh, crap. I forgot to see how this thing did. Oh, 88. So we only paid $90,000. That's really good. Progress. So let's see. Um. Let's flip this around and look at our university. I know we can put a sign out there, right? Um, click. Lovely sign. University. Hello. Welcome to the University of Pedadelphia. Let's see. We've got some dorms we can put out. You know what? We're going to stick these dorms over here where everyone, like, hates life. There's, like, an empty thing there. And put another one. Or can we put another one? right there then um, it's a school of business we already had that added right so just add that on there so we get our profit back up we can put another dormitory somewhere it's a good place to put a dormitory not enough simoleons oh my gosh oh we're losing 20,000 an hour and I have oh no <laughs> I forgot that I I have limited resources. <laughs> Oops. Um. Wow. Okay. Well, this will be interesting. Let's see. Uh. No. Let's look at our budget. Let's let's give ourselves another little loan. Do we, can we get another bond out? Oh man, this sucks. Okay. We're gonna accept another bond. That will just give us a little leeway till our petroleum or whatever goes through. <laughs> Trade depot is making us a little money. How's that doing? Okay, we just got our drilling money, so that that's gonna help us out quite a bit. We're losing twenty-one thousand dollars an hour. Awesome. But uh, the, the having the university there will actually increase profit, so that's important. Um, we could put another dorm down just to go ahead and max out our dorms. Um, let's see, where are we? Worker shortage. Schools don't have enough. Let's see. Um. Get that another dorm going. Just we'll have the we'll max out on dorms. You know, it, it would fit right here, wouldn't it? How is this business doing? Freight shipments making profits. Freight selling really well. 
like ready to expand. Ugh. Let's find someone that's sad and put put take them out. Where is the shopping in this town? Okay, that is part of the university. Okay, let's look at our uh, happiness map thing. Um, here, we'll just use the main data map. Let's look for sad faces. <clears throat> this guy looks sad. Business is okay. Hmm. Business is okay. Oh, this guy's sad. No money. Moving soon. Okay. Um, guess what? You're about to have... Well, that's uh, this is the high wealth area, I'm pretty sure. Yeah, this is a high wealth area, so we really don't want to put a dorm there. Let's see. No, I think I'm just going to stick another dorm right here. No, we have to do it this way. Um, it's going to take out quite a few buildings. Darn it. Oh, that's the freight shipment that makes a lot of profit, guy. Hmm. Why can't it stick it right there? Damn it. Just let go. Oh, that takes that guy out. Oh, what about right here? No, well, that takes out that huge tower. This is the high wealth area. You know what? I'm just gonna stick it right there. Did I? Did I do it? No, I guess not. Here, I'm gonna put it here. Okay. Get out of that. Um. So, that's that. We have 115,000 people now. Uh, we lost quite a few in that last little bit. We lost 20,000 people. That's that's gonna. That's why we're we're like in such in the red. Um, why are the nine? Why are we at nine percent taxes? I oh because I took out the uh, city hall. Okay, so let's do um, and so it reset all my tax. That's that's has a lot to do with what's going on. So we're gonna do eleven across the board for middle class, and we're gonna do twelve across the board for upper wealth. And they're just gonna have to not like that for a while because we need to get our money back. Let's see, let's get out of the education map here. Um, yeah, so we're now at 11,000 an hour on deficit. So it's, we're doing awesome. Um, it's 6.28 a.m. I'm going to go ahead and schedule another event. Um, let's see. We just did a lot. It seems like I have to do the, the motorcycle guy again, so I'll do him. I'm just going to do, I'm just cycling through them so that there's a very a variety there. Obviously, if I do always do the uh, the high wealth or whatever, the rock concert thing, that's, you know, they're not going to come to that every time. Otherwise, that would just be the easiest thing to do. Um, I don't know if I'm, there's such a thing as expo fatigue, but we'll see. Um. got about seven or eight minutes left of this episode so let's see what this says about tourists our town is getting to be quite a tourist attraction we should treat the uh the tourists by adding a lion mark i'll do it so let's go look at our tourist options here um tourist specializations approved not approved what Oh, we need a Department of Tourism. <sighs> Guys, you suckered me into it. So we need a Department of Tourism and a Department of Transportation in our next city. And next episode, you know, no matter what, we're going to flip over to the next city. So, because um, I think with our added petroleum output, I think that we're going to be doing, we're going to be doing okay now.
Yeah, this is doing 11,000 barrels a day, and this one's doing 7,600 a day. Um, it would be awesome if we could afford, what is the gambling people? They're going to say, do a gambling. Uh, poor tourist attendance. The other person just said we're doing awesome with tourism. <laughs> okay, doesn't make sense. But look at our tourist map here. So we've got all mid-wealth um, people. And we got some high-wealth people over here. Is this insiders trading? Um, got some mid-wealth people over here. What is this? Oh, a Jeremy place. That's nice. Um, here. Can we do anything about that? Let's look at our... Why is it red now? Terrible tourist attendance. We just said we were doing off awesome, and now they're saying we're doing badly. That doesn't make any sense. Um... Okay, event is coming at 8 p.m. So there's already people. <laughs> they're such fans of motocross that they're already, uh, you know, buying tickets at 11.47 in the morning for an 8 p.m. show. They're just, they're already there. <laughs> it's real to me. <laughs> That's, have you ever seen that video? Uh, the guy who's crying at a wrestling, like, interview. Quite a Q and A thing. He starts crying. He says it's real to me. <laughs> Pro wrestling. Pro wrestling isn't real, by the way. Um, in my opinion. <laughs> okay, so the people are complaining about shopping now. So let's look at our zonification here. Okay, there's not really any shops here at all. Um, they're a great place to shop. Okay. I don't know. Have you talked to your neighbors up here? We need... We need money now. Hmm. What's going on over here? Why is there a helicopter? Oh, there's a fire. Okay. Oh, no. There's a fire. <laughs> um, yes, I'm going to just make a bunch of YouTube video references. Look, a triple rainbow. There. Have we done them all? Um, I can't think of any other ones. Oh, I was I was going to look at pollution before I got all distracted. Um, let's see. Health. Ground pollution map. Okay. Um, let's go to our park situation. Can we stick any of these trees in here? Here, let's pop out of this. Give me some trees here, buddy. I swear we planted trees here before. Whatever. Now there's more. <laughs> Okay. Where was that Jeremy place? It was over by the casino, right? How are we doing? It's 450. How's our little uh, event doing here? Okay, so we're making a profit. That's the important thing. Um. You spend a dollar and you make a dollar and a penny, you made a profit. That's the way I look at it. All right, it looks like all the trees I planned up here, most of them have died, so we're we'll gonna throw some more in over here. Try to get, get this healthier. Now, someone was complaining about commercial areas, but I don't really see how we can really... I don't see how to stick them in, because that's kind of our low wealth-ish area, <laughs> so I kind of want... I kind of want to... Uh, I kind of want to make sure that that place stays low wealth. And um, we're already so short-handed on low wealth positions that I kind of don't want to risk, you know, um, dezoning part of it to make a commercial area. Hmm. But you know what? There is a there is 
there is a blank space right here. So l l let me look at my zoning thing real fast. Okay, you know what? Well, it's blank because there's nothing there. High wealth taxes are too high. Okay. Keep that in mind, buddy. Okay, so we put a little business there. Um, oh, look, there's a little tiny road from back when we had the solar deal. Okay, so um, band a building and one rubble. There's a rubble. Where's this rubble? Where's my bulldoze tool? Alright. Oh, crap! It's not coming. Okay, the fountain plaza is gone now. So let's go ahead and put that back up. Um, I must have been from the aliens or something. Uh, parks, 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 parks. Our time is up, so I'm just going to do this real fast. Let's see. Oh. Reflecting pool park. It's too big. Fence, fountain, plaza. Why don't you fit now, you stupid jerk? Uh, small fountain park. Everything takes out the stupid thing now. Large fountain, reflecting pool, small fountain park. <sighs> well, I don't want to take out a nice big building. Takes out all that stuff. Take out this. Alright, I'm just going to put it there. Okay, well. Oh, let's see how our event did. Woohoo! 28,000 <coughs> simoleons. Awesome. Um, yeah, so that'll be it for today. Next time I come back, we're going to start a new city, even though this one is in the red. I'm just going to have to hope that the petroleum and whatnot uh, keeps it going. And we'll get a Department of Tourism and a Department of Transportation as soon as possible. <coughs> and, uh, yeah, um, hopefully that will keep us, uh, that will help in the long run help this city fix itself. And like I said, I learned a lot of lessons from this. The f next place we look at, we're going to very carefully determine where all the mineral resources, if there are any, um, first. And then we're going to figure out where everything is going to go ahead of time and we're not going to expand too quickly so we don't end up with a big mess like this anyway we'll see you next time pd out